Welcome to USL Live into week eight of season 23 in the Unified Skirmish League. I'm your host, Rami Locks, and the game tonight is between Pay Pigs and Warhawks. Warhawks dropped their first game of the season last week against ATW, and they are looking to redeem that loss. But Pay Pigs have a lot to prove themselves as these two play a head to head match that will be repeated again next week in the opening round of the season 23 playoffs. For more information on the teams, match statistics, and how you can sign up to play in the Unified Skirmish League, we ask that you please visit USLZone.com. Joining me in the commentary booth for tonight's match, I'm honored to welcome in Yosh. Hey. And Eric. Meow. Eric, welcome back. Um, Pay Pigs come into this game tonight 6-3 and three on the season in third place in the standings, while Warhawks are in second place with eight wins and one loss. No matter what happens tonight, the standings are set moving into the playoffs. But Pay Pigs still have a lot to prove. So far this season, they haven't been able to stand up to either of the top two squads, anything to win or Warhawks. And they will likely have to defeat both of these teams in playoffs if they want to take over the home the Golden Goblet this season. At the same time, Warhawks will be looking to get their mojo back as they lick their wounds from a close, lo- a close loss to ATW in Week 7. Will Warhawks slide off right before playoffs begin? Or is this the start of the comeback tour? Let's ask the panel, Eric and Yosh, how do you see today going for these teams and how important is tonight's result in light of the rematch next week? Let's go with Yosh first. So I think this is a pretty important match for both teams. Uh, right now we have, I, I, is this going to be a 7v7 match? That's Noss is in as well for pay pigs. Like, I don't know if they, he's a late season addition or if they're using him as an NT or what's going on with that, but that changes everything. If Noss is playing in this game, watch out. Eric, how about you? Yeah. I mean, the way I look at it is Paypigs has been as being essentially all week, and this is a new map, whereas Warhawks has kind of died down in activity. And for a new map and kind of morale low, I, I kind of give a little bit of favor towards Paypigs, and I think they're going to slow things down. And, you know, Warhawks on these ball-ups that they like to do need to be careful because Paypigs are going to be ambushing that ball-up. And I know uh, SV has been consulting the Dark Lord himself on possible ways to defeat these guys. So it's it's a big match for both. And, uh, you know, I uh, I still think Warhawks pulls it out. But with Nazin, I don't know. That's uh, I mean, quite the... <laughs> that's an addition. Yeah. yeah. They also have Lunatic in, and we're still waiting on a seventh. But Kevin has returned. We saw how, how important Kevin was for that roster to succeed. Um, but, you know, Victim and Manu uh, as, as your meds. Looks like they're adding Ghost Bomber. So this is a fairly inexperienced version of PayPigs' roster, uh, although they are adding Nas, as you guys are pointing out. Uh, and Nas Keeper is a, is a slayer. No, no ifs, ands, or buts about it. So it'll be really interesting to see how that changes their roster. I'm not sure if he's joined on site or if he's just a straight NT. But um, I, I guess let's do some predictions here. Uh, Yosh, how do you think it finishes? Well. Where is Splitter? It's interesting. He's in the arena. He just talked to me. My understanding is he's been caught in the garage a few times. They just went up to eight, though, uh, adding Splitter. So there, Splitter is in, uh, and we have uh, the true eight for Warhawks here as well. Uh, okay. Although you're using Slob uh, oh, instead okay. of Blitz or somebody in. like that. Yeah. Um, so... This is far be it from Pay Pigs' best lineup. Um, no Havoc. Yeah, no Havoc. No Daddy. Yeah. Right. Um, who else are they? You got a fake norm? Samara in there. Call that out. I think that's Victim. I think. No, that's, sure. uh, that's SV. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, okay. Okay. Um, that's right. interesting. Typhoon in too now. Uh, so victim is not in. So you're, um, I don't even know who's running on the other team as far as medics right now. I'm uh, assuming it's going to be LT and Manu. Okay. I think LT is going to switch, and of course Manu the the standard there. Okay. <clears throat> I mean, just hear me out on this. I heard a rumor that Nostro 500 miles <laughs> to play in this game. <laughs> I also heard said rumor. Would he drive 500 more, though, do you think? 
I mean, just to be the hey, man for a chance to kill Kaga, absolutely. Falls in love with you. Um, yeah, where is the real Danny? I need. I want a protest to start as well, Mecca. Where's the real Danny? What have you done with him? Yeah. Um, where is League Two? I haven't seen both of those guys on. We we could have used him today. We're two minutes over here, boys. Let's go. Game time. Oh. Eights v eights. So, uh, the way God intended. So, this looks bad. So, if SV keeps the score low, um, the thing is, he doesn't really have the side to camp a whole lot, mm -hmm. which is smart on Warhawks. They took that left side away from him. You know, the the last match, the ATW versus Crab Shooters, Crab Shooters gave a, a pretty good example on how to play this map using vision bugs and stuff like that. But on this side, you really can't do that. So it's going to be really interesting to see what kind of style Warhawks decides to take. If they're just going to take it on them with Slob in. You know, is he playing Ripper today? Let's see. Slob's med. Uh, so yeah. is Stav. Oh. So Staley's Marine. Yeah, so it's basically okay. the it's basically the, the best roster Warhawks can play minus that, you know, maybe oh. Blitz. Blitz or soul. Uh, a Soul. Yeah, it depends on who you get. But we have, we haven't had Soul or Blitz most of the season. So this has been their standard, I think their standard roster all season pretty much. Um, but uh, yeah, I agree that uh, this is not the PayPay's best roster. Eric, Eric, Eric what do you think uh, the final score is today? Um, it, it completely changes now that it went from sevens to eights. I think um, Warhawks has a, a better lineup to kind of spread out with the numbers. Again, I know they're still going to do their ball up, but I'm going to go roughly... 45 to 36 in favor of Warhawks. Okay. Wow. That's that's real generous, Eric. Yeah. I do not think this is going to be a close game. Unfortunately, I think Warhawks blows them out. I will say, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to take your score from the <laughs> next escape 75 25. <laughs> <laughs> I. <laughs> I think I think pay pigs can punish a inactive Stavadine, which we did last week. I think they punish a Marine and Staley. I I think it's going to be close. I would say uh, fifty two thirty two Warhawks. I think it's not going to be that close, but uh, I, I yeah, I just think Warhawks are going to out out outclass them, out veteran them here. Um, We'll Never see. mind. Score, score just shut up. Typhoon's playing demo. Game yeah. over. Uh, Tactical <laughs> is also playing demo, so that'll be well, it'll be interesting. The I, battle of I the demos. I don't understand why Typhoon's not playing Marine or LMG. He's doing really well when he was playing those classes. Is, is uh, Mountain playing AT? Uh, I can't tell play. his jersey color. It's, no, no, he's Marine. Because okay. you would see the energy by his name if he was AT. Interesting yeah. Typhoon isn't going with AT. He's been kind of playing on it all season. I've been given information that Typhoon may be having issues with his hotspot. Oh, so, oh. so that's why he's playing demo. Because it won't show the lag as much. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> big brain play right there, if that's true. Nas is playing <laughs> Ripper. Ooh. Got our first contact here at South Mid. Splitta and Staley. Getting oh, a little tete -a -tete. Nas, Nas is going to get sneaky here. He's going to kill Staley if Staley goes through this. Uh, Mountain going on the far right here, fighting Fairfax on the wide right. Ernie, Stav, and Kaga pushing through the middle. Ooh. <laughs> oh, Warhawks has actually got a good stream here going right now. Um, Pay Pigs is kind of near their base, making it hard to ball up and push on them. Kaga scoring some decent hits on Nas, but Nas getting some back. Oh, it's tough. To... Ooh. Kaga gets a heal, and they're back in it. Actually, you're right. Paypig's doing a good job of holding on the right side. It could be tighter right now the way it's looking. 
Staley is Stay in trouble. Staley Staley's in trouble here. Oh, Staley. Oh, Splitta gets streamed. Slob doesn't see him yet, I don't think. One oh. for one, though. Good kill from Kevin. Nas versus Tactical. Ertie hits two RPGs on Nas. Takes Nas down. He's low, though. Ghost Bobber. Oh, already eating a part of the part Got of the law there, too. There. Yeah. Splitter going down. Yeah, I mean, he ate every single bullet that Kaga threw at him. You know, is that, is that a little bit of rush showing right now from Splitter? Fairfax coming down on Ghost Bomber again here in the building. We'll see. Oh, I could see Typhoon moving a little fast right there. Him playing demo is actually pretty smart because it is hard to tell if he's lagging or not. They're going to get out positioned here as uh, this team gets in South Ghost Mid. Bomber. Oh, oh! Ernie yeah, barely misses RPG. that. Oh, Nas taking a lot of fire here, though. He needs a heal. Ghost Bobber, what are you doing? SV's got a good solo angle up top, yeah, too. Yeah, Fax did a good job of checking him up there. They're going to fall out of the building, it looks like. Good even fight here in mid. Splitter's going to go down again here. Oh, Kaga takes a bunch oh. of bullets, though. Oh, is he baiting Fax? Kaga and Gift in trouble. Slob needs to get to them up north. Nas Ernie down. Just... Stav is going to go Ooh. down now, too. Oh. Nas, what are you doing? He is getting it right now. He drove 500 miles to kill some Warhawks today. Take <laughs> down another down. one. That's my boy right there. <laughs> Get him, Nas. Sorry. I'm a Nas fan boy. Always have been. Always will be. <laughs> I, I mean, <laughs> I'm a sh shameless about it. I'm, I'm totally fine with it. He hadn't played all season. Steps in, and there's the MVP. There's yep. the league MVP we know. Typhoon pushing hard south. Oh, Typhoon good, hits an RPG, RPG on Rio. Rio about to go down here. Slob doing a good job keeping him up, though. Splitter, you got to hit a bullet, bud. Oh, man. Rio gets great hits on Splitter. Oh. Slob is uh, he goes down. just trying to survive as Rio is clutching south. Yeah, Splitter goes down. Ghost Bomber down. LT is stuck. He He's going to get out. Yep. Daily goes down. Hey, pigs up, 7-4. Oh. Fairfax and Stav, just veteran play up north here. They need to get out. I don't know why they're staying here. Kevin's dead. LT LT's is going dead. down. Man, he's going to die now, too. Warhawks have completely turned around what was looking like a very solid pay picks position. I'm not sure I Manu mean, makes it out here. No, he's dead. Oh, Manu wow. Oh, died. wow. Oh. But he kind of he kind of little let Nas out to dry a little bit. Fairfax Nos almost takes Nas. All those guys had to be sub twenty. Yeah. I mean, Nas can only do so much, guys. He's he needs some help. Splitter, you got to pick it up. Yeah, Splitter's looking lost on the sauce. Yeah. Looking like a true plumber, if you will. We had the argument of you can't just step in just to play playoffs. You got to warm up with everybody else week to week. I mean, that's, didn't he say he was one of the best five players left in the game at, on on the site? I don't. I didn't see that comment. Can't speak to it. Sounds about right, though. Nas is doing a good job just holding off this team right now. Looking like Splitter getting uh, good hits right now on Fairfax and Stav. Stav is keeping him alive though as he retreats. Ooh, Stav out of position though. That top team for Paypigs needs to do something because Ooh, yeah. right now Nas has four to five in these rocks. Well, Nas is holding them back right now. Him, Typhoon are doing a good job keeping this team. That's just even numbers here. And this top team's actually getting overwhelmed right now. Ernie comes yep. south, try to help out. He's going to turn and get some hits here, hopefully. Nope. Oh, but Slob takes a hit. Oh, Nas gets in good position to hit Rio. Rio's been really held, you know, at bay this game. Mostly been playing defense. Oh, Nas is holding back four right now. This north Nas group looks like somebody's going down soon. 
They are fighting in the Splitter. wide open, and nobody is going down. Oh, Splitter, Splitter yeah. goes down. Tactical gets a tactical. nice law from behind. Fucking plumbers, dude. <laughs> uh, Ghost Bomber goes down. Kaga is low on the north. Stav goes for the save. This whole thing is going to die now. Yeah. You can hey, Pigs. Go ahead, Eric. Uh, okay. Uh, Pay Pig's top team, while Nas and Typhoon had five trapped in the rocks, their top team needed to push over and around and collapse on their north team. Yeah. And they just didn't. LT what happens when you down. camp? What happens when you practice camping and not pushing? That's what. That's the kind of thing I'm talking about. Like LT, over time, there's some veteran play here that's gonna happen. Warhawks just has it. Okay, right now. Typhoon, Ty Typhoon's going down here. He's trying to law that exo. Ooh, almost, almost took Fairfax. Exo. Yeah. <laughs> One more shotgun and he has him. Hey, pigs is stuck in their base right now. The wheels are about to come off. Fourteen to seven, though. It's certainly not off yet. Uh, Twenty-one yeah. minutes remaining in this game. Pay pigs just got to get it together. Uh, and they I get mean, right back in this. Nas's Ripper has been a real problem for Warhawks. Yeah. I mean, it doesn't matter what class he plays, but I do think Ripper is just so effective right now, and it'll destroy you real quick. Yeah. Especially he is the he is the sole reason keeping Pay Pigs in this game right now. I thought he was the only re only thing that kept Septic or Septic was the only thing that kept them in that game uh, with NYPD. Um, he was keeping us at bay over and over again, taking one or two of us down every time. Oh yeah, Ripper's, the, Ripper's was, rough. Yeah, pushing it. I mean, we know. Me and Eric know about trying to push into Soul as a Ripper. That's rough. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but he needs the supporting cast to kind of, he needs the actual Pay Pigs players to kind of show up and play a little bit here. Warhawks keeping their form really well. Everybody's dropping left at the same time. They've got Kaga going through the building. He's going to run Ghost right Bomber into Ghost Bomber. Kaga. Ghost Bomber, law him. Everybody else stays alive south. Bailey is pushing oh, up. Oh, Ghost Bomber does three. get a really good hit. Man, you takes a law, though. Yeah, He's Staley low. took a lot of hits right there. Oh, Sav is down. Ooh, that was unfortunate. Drop, took a uh, one of Typhoon's hits, as Ooh. did Staley just now. You know, we were... Oh, Typhoon is kind of on point with these Yeah, he's, he's nailing them. Good law. Oh. Nas, well, there Nas. he is with that ripper. Yeah, Splitter, this is your time. They're in a choke. Light them up. Pay Pigs has got the position on them. Slop did a good job to keep them alive there. Watch that law. Fairfax is almost down again. They're, they're, they need to wrap this up quick. If not, that, that respawn team is going to come around and kill them. Or are they just going to back out of it? Ooh, this south team is hurting. Almost. Yeah. Good demo. Rio's oh. in a bad spot. Tactical here. did not get a heal there, so Tactical might go down right here. Oh, Rio and Stavridon are going to go down yep. again. Good job by Typhoon taking that angle. And Typhoon's... Staley stabilized. gets a kill on Typhoon. It's evens again. Four on four. Oh, nah, but I don't four think... four on three down here on the south. Splitter doing a good job holding up Kaga and Ahmed up here. Mm. Yikes. Warhawks getting turned on right now. It is Whoa. 15 all as uh, Paypig surge back to the tie with 18.50 remaining. We got a game, boys. Yeah, this is not going to be the blowout that I thought. You know, pay pigs have been exactly excellent. The foot, motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> Look, I'm sticking it though, Eric. <laughs> well, this is what we've been saying. I've been saying all along is that pay pigs have got to prove that they can play like this. And if they actually add nods to their roster, I don't know if that's all we haven't checked on the site, but if that's if if he's added to the roster, they are playoff competitors. It hasn't happened on site. Um they, it can't happen on site. They've got 14. Yeah, they've got 14, okay. so it's a no-go. Uh, do we even allow NTs in playoffs? I'm not allowing if, it. If captains yeah. agree, yes. I think there's a specific rule about that. Yeah, captains legit have to agree. But they can boot somebody and add Nas, I think, still. No, 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 no. no, no. Roster roster it's locked. I thought roster lock only applied to players that weren't squad joined or to players you, that you were squad joined. You, you, you can't, can't pick anybody, though. Oh, okay. Okay. Interesting. So this was the last chance Nas had to play, and he took it. Yep. Yeah. I mean, he drove 500 miles to get here. 
You know, he was he was actually going to play in that NYPD game, to be honest. And mm-hmm. that dude what decided an MT not that would have been. Him. Mountain caught out a little bit Ooh, here. iPhone takes an RPG there. Gif may get a kill on Mountain here. It's one on one. SV is eating some bad bullets here. Oh, they're pushing up on him. Kevin, Kevin's got a good, good stream on Stav here. He's low. His energy's gone. Typhoon, good demo here. SV's getting, getting turned on. SV is getting turned on. So they need to take that down. team. Tacticals down. Stavidine's down. Fairfax is down. Oh my gosh, they won the right side while SV just delayed them on the left. Kaga's going to go down. down too. Paypigs is doing it, boys. Oh my word. Paypigs is up 19 to 16 as Warhawks just don't keep shape. Uh, and Kevin is out there pushing ahead. He said, I'm not scared of y'all. Try to fight a, down to Rio. Try to fight a war on two fronts as Staley Ooh. narrowly misses a uh, demo yeah. there. Bad push out from, from Paypigs there, yeah. man. You goes down. Silly death there in a moment where you didn't need one. Paypigs were looking really good momentum wise. Good <laughs> law there. Oh, but it's a medic, so they're fine. Still a little bit of rough shape. Warhawks is gonna look to push the pressure here on Kevin and yep. oh, they get back to gonna... respawn. It's gonna yeah, be a full reset here. Nineteen all as the next battle is going to be very important. Hey, Big's looking looking good here. Looking good for playoffs right now. Now, some would say it's the map. You know, maybe this map doesn't favor Warhawks' more ball up and push type of style. You'd think so, though, because it's very no. open. No, um, this map is rough to do that. And you cannot ball up on this map and ex ha expect to have a lot of success. I think typically Warhawks rely on their on their focus fire from their teammates a lot too. I haven't seen a lot of like dual or triple streaming on anybody so far from Warhawks. Well, a big part of Warhawks' game is actually just turning on one team. You know, that's a good law. But they're not. Oh, that's very good. That's very good. Nas has got free oh, rain on Gift is in trouble. They're going down. Yeah, they're, they're dead. Gift's going to try and take one here though. He's going to try and take Kevin. He's low. Oh, oh, Typhoon gets a double RPGs. hit. Dude, Typhoon yeah. has been impressive in this game. I know I was glazing over Nos, but Typhoon has hit a good percentage of his RPGs. 22 Maybe to 21. His... Paypigs take the lead. Has he found his class? Has, has he been hiding this all along? Typhoon Ooh, in the Typhoon door. Is going in. Look at him. Yeah. No he fear. ain't scared. Oh, good luck. Oh, but he goes oh. down. Wow, that was kind of BS. He should have taken Kaga there. Kaga knows it, too. Oh, good law from Kevin. Almost takes Kaga. Fairfax with a good flank, though. Yep. SV goes down. Kevin in a one-on-one -on -one with Kaga. I think Kaga's winning. Oh, no. Law takes it from behind. Fax. They have to kill Fax here. Fax is going to kill Nos. Manu says oh, thank Nos you for that explosion. Street. Gets him out of the combat. Staley goes down. Oh, this gift is going to come around and fight. What an though. interesting they don't battle! The gift is, is about to make this. Boom! Law split it dead. Chaos. That's LT dead. Is. Kevin is real low. Nas is down. Warhawk. Oh, gift goes this down and oh, he. Oh, that's a death he did, probably didn't need. It's three v four right now as they rush out the north door, trying for Manu and Ghost Bomber. 27-26, Warhawks takes the lead back. They need these deaths if they can get them, but I think they're done. I think they need to back out and fall now. Gift doing a good job there, just making it happen on the fly. Yep. Rio War in a little, little bit of trouble. Warhawks nice. will back it out. They're going to retreat. They probably should get out the uh, west side of mid here. But they're oh they see the fight going on right below. They're gonna try to help out. Kaga getting that far south position. Nas is gonna meet Earth him. Bomber taking some bad bullets. Look at this save from Nas Earth about to happen dead. though. Yeah, Nas is he's coming in. Oh doesn't Ghost get there bomber. in time. 
Manu stuck in the building here, though. Manu down. Manu down. He thought he was going to get a heal through the wall and be sneaky. LT's got to keep this whole team alive now. He's dead. Oh, LT down. Typhoon down. Oh, what a disaster play and moment for Pay Pigs. Let the base rape commence. Now, this is where Warhawk can really take advantage of Pay Pigs. All right? Warhawks is yep. all together. They're in an open area. This is. If I was them, I'd look to keep them engaged here. Warhawks falls. 32 to 26. I think they're happy just to hold a lead. Probably get in a defensive position. Yeah, this map is a. This map sucks. I don't like playing on this map. I think it's definitely different than the other stuff. So, I mean, if uh, I think there probably do need to be some modifications. Definitely some vision bugs we have to address pretty quick. Yeah. Oh, nice. Nah. Hit slob a little bit here. Gift is caught out. Gift is in, He's in trouble. Gift is down. Just gets streamed, gets caught out a little bit. I think it's going to be time for them to fall. Warhawks needs to turn and run. Save those deaths. And they do. Rio going far north to join Vicaga and, and Jason. Fairfax trying to get out as well. They're so overextended, though. Ooh, slobbing in a bad position here. He's taking a lot of fire. He's about to die. Ooh, Nas can get an angle He's... on him. Nope. Yeah, they're going to get out. All retreating into north mid now. Typhoon's just holding them. Good job on Slob. Kevin gets in the north, uh, south mid as well. Oh, good pinch on this north group here. Rio in trouble. LT, he needs to dodge a little bit here. He needs to not need die. To focus Rio, Rio down. Oh, Staley is lighting up LT. Kevin, uh, he, Kevin kills tactical. Kevin, yeah, Law, takes boom. tactical. Almost gets Slob with a, with a nice law. Staley and Slob fight it out inside. Kevin knows he's going down, so he's going to try and so take Slob with him. Can't uh, do it. Almost. Ghost Bomber, questionable law. There's been a lot yeah. of trades here, just just trading deaths. Uh, Typhoon going down. Here goes Ghost Bomber next as Kaga pushes in. This is the, this oh, is Kaga wall. goes down <laughs> though. Whoa, takes it. Absolutely unnecessary death. Nos Staley no. might take one here too. Oh, no. Yep. Staley goes no, down. Staley goes down. Warhawks in a bad spot here. If they just, can kill facts. Just playing very silly in a moment where you don't need this at all. This is some rest play right now. They need to help out SV, I think that is, is the fake Samara, right? Oh, yes. Jason is down. Yep. Warhawks, oh, a little over aggressive. 38 right now. 33. Really important deaths right now for Rio, Slob, and Gift to get out and stay alive. Somebody once said Fax drove 500 miles to troll <laughs> Warhawks. What a god. <laughs> <laughs> Fosto dropping knowledge he says rumor has it Eric is taking over as admin next season no 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 <laughs> absolutely not uh, looks like Warhawks is going to meet him again in south mid uh, rest of Warhawks is over in dropping out of west mid now let me just say congratulations, Eric, on being admin yet again. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Welcome to the staff. You can never leave. It's like the Hotel California. Yeah. No, 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 no. <laughs> hey, Pig's down five here. Interesting that, you know, this game has been not a lot Warhawks closer. Is, not Go ahead. Warhawks going. Yeah, this has not been the Warhawks we've seen all season. You know, Eric might come pretty close to nailing this score. Oh yeah. Uh, depending, I think, although we got eight minutes left, so anything could happen. But oh, SV slithering around here. Pop his head out. Staley, in a little bit of a bad position with that oh, ripper. Oh, Slob. Yep. Oh. oh, Staley is going down. down. Yep. Nas once again just tags him up. Yeah, real sloppy game from. Well, I mean, I think it's on. just the the. I mean, Slob is low. Really good ripper placement from Same Nas, though. too. Just put those bullets in a position where he had no choice but to run into them. Didn't see the first three, I don't think. Ghost Bobber goes down somehow. 
That's so, a bad death. That's a death you didn't need when you're up one. Yeah. Ghost Bomber has uh, not looked up to par this game. Even in one-on-one -on -one situations that I've watched, he's just not dodging. Good law from SV. A little long, though. Typhoon looking to slow up the advance again. Typhoon has had an outrageously good game. I think. Yeah, he's played real good. Between him and Nas, man, the special classes are doing absolute work for Paypigs this game. Yeah, the Marines are kind of trolling. Split it right now. Trying to get involved in that action south. He has not. He's not been great, but uh, he's doing, I guess, what he needs to do. Nas once again he's... puts <clears throat> hits on Kaga. Kaga should be dead. Yep, yep. Kaga's down. Yep. I mean, good job. Split is. Split has uh, stepped it up the second half. Look at that. He, he was playing like a true plumber, but. Well, I, I, when you watch the recording back, people maybe see what Nas is doing. He is absolutely like, he puts his shots in a straight line that forces them to not go that direction, and then his teammates just cr shoot them as he closes the gap more and more and more. Uh, it's really smart play. I and mean, Paypigs is wiping hit. this up right here. They're going to get they're gonna get three, four kills out of this battle. Boom. Oh, if that, if that I RPG know. hits. Yeah, Jason and Gift absolutely given a gift there by avoiding yeah. that one. So, Paypix need to be careful about being over-aggressive here, though. Like, you're going to have Respawn coming out. You're flanking. Nas has got the hit on Rio. Oh, Gift is going to go down, I think. Yep. That, law doesn't that hit. was a really bad decision from Gift to push Ghost Bomber way harder than he had any business doing. Uh, Rio is down in the south as well. Uh, Paypigs are in the lead, 41-39 with five minutes, six minutes to go, just under. Yeah, Paypigs is looking very good. They pick up some more kills here too. This is you know, what a huge switch. I mean, they're gonna have to fall. Man who died though. Yeah. Forty-three forty. That's what they should do anyway. Paypigs should 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 get back and let Warhawks come to them now. I mean, they've been doing a good job just being a little bit more proactive, um, you know, catching, you know, Warhawks off guard. It doesn't look like Warhawks is trying to play to their strengths. You know, maybe it's the map. It doesn't really factor in the, what Warhawks is really strong at, which is basically going and pushing one side, you know, pushing the, the weak side, you know? I mean, there's so many, um, I don't want to say physics, but... Um just like mountains and buildings all kind of grouped together. So if you ball up on this map and do that, you're just going to catch laws, nades, etc. And like you said earlier, the special classes in Typhoon and Nas have really... Oh. Ghost Bomber caught out, though. Uh -oh. Ghost Bomber's in trouble again. He's dead. Maybe. Manu had a great... great uh, Kevin with a great law up there, but no, he is dead now. Oh, Slob almost oh, goes slob. down to that one. Oof. Uh, as the other guys are in south mid here. Warhawks looks like they're going to back out. They're going to take their, their one kill and, you know, reposition. Yep. Pushing it south. They're going to switch. It looks like go to south mid. One Kaga and Ernie stab to get that far south position, it sounds like. Key position. Ernie switched from demo to marine. Oh, he said, I've had enough of this. He's like, yep. right, we, we need marine power. You know, maybe maybe Soul is the key factor for this Warhawks lineup. Oh, I think he's a huge piece. When he's there, that's definitely the best team. Um, Slava hasn't done a – he hasn't been the reason for the loss here, but I think that Soul, in terms of what he adds to team shooting, is huge. What a good law there. Almost LT did a good job of healing them out of that. A little bit of a rough position here from – Nas is getting focused out, but he's going to stay yeah. up. And to do more harm for Kaga here. LT trying to do some weird stuff. He's about to die here. Kaga's about to go in on him. LT down. Ooh. He is low. LT, you need to... What are you doing? Stick on Nas. Yeah. There's literally a physic for you to hide on. Like, there, here's, this is what Warhawks is good at right here. Look, there's six of them in this spot. Trying to focus down LT and Nas, and they're going to get it. There's the Warhawks oh. team shooting right yeah. there. But now they're bunched up, though. But they've got their two-man advantage. Nas oh, Slob up, goes down. Really, Nas really important up. kill there for Paypigs. Oh, he's dead. 
Can they take uh, SV in trouble now? Yeah, he's going to go down. One more. Yep. Kaga on the far left with Gift. They're missing. Slob needs to get back in the action so fast for Warhawks. They need him. Oh, that tied the... Yeah, Warhawks back in the lead. 47-44 now. Two minutes and 20 seconds to go. This is going to come down to the wire, folks. Yeah. Kaga Split is it. in trouble. He's Kaga down. Goes down. Oh, Split it Two coming kills. up huge. 47-45 as Warhawks tear off to the left. Split it coming in clutch. He heard all the trash that we were talking about him. He said, I'm still here. Said I may be in the garage after this game, but for right now, for this <laughs> second, I'm in this game. Kaga putting up another another game of huge numbers. I haven't looked at the breakdown all game. Let's catch up on that real quick. Kaga twelve and nine, big game for him. Tactical ten and six, also a big game. Kevin and SV both nine and five. Uh, Manu leading the heels by seven hundred points. With LT and Stab behind him. Oh, Paypig's in a rough spot here. Yeah. They need to get out of this. There's three guys it's above the bunker. Yeah, they get out successfully. Warhawks. SV stays. Yeah. Uh, I'm, I'm okay here. Warhawks is in a stalemate right now. Oh, they're, they've got 60 seconds. You still have time to work, guys. You don't have yeah, to freak out yet. Of course, yet. I'd probably say Ghost Bomber's going to have to be involved from the north. He's going to have to get shots down, make them focus on him. I mean, you Ghost Bomber, you have a favorable matchup here with yeah, Staley. you you got to get out there, dude. you got to win that. Kaga over-aggressive here. Draw Slob to him. Oh, good shots by SV. He's got good hits on Slob. Slob has to dive out. Oh, no, oh. LT almost catches a nade from Kaga. Kevin kills Stavadine. This is, this is losable. You got 33 seconds, guys. You got to work. Oh, Gift takes five shots. He's real low now. They got to kill this North team. Kaga needs Kaga to go down in here. trouble. Kaga is in real trouble. They're it's... calling for Kaga on the focus. Oh, Kaga, Kaga down. down somehow. LT Four. goes down, though. 48-47. Warhawks in the lead with 13 seconds. Ghost Bobber, get fucking Staley. What are you doing? Oh, my gosh. This pay pig's really going to lose this because Ghost Bobber refuses to push. Oh, Ty Fairfax game. goes down! Oh. Typhoon goes down! Tie game! Tie game! <laughs> 49's <laughs> all oh, tie game! <laughs> this is what we wanted right here. <laughs> I don't even know the rules, guys. Someone's going to have to tell me. Do a tie game in a regular uh -oh. season, we just stay? Tie, it, it goes to OT, 7v7. Okay. All Marines, one death. Okay. Uh -oh. This is going to be exciting. This is going to be exciting. Uh, let's get a, an update on that breakdown and look at what happened there. Uh, Kevin and Kaga with 12 kills each. Not sure on the death total, but Tactical with 10 and 6. All three of those guys have had excellent games. Uh, another one, I think Typhoon is really not on that list, but he deserves to be. Uh, Manu, LT, and Slob. Manu is just, he is a thousand points above everybody else right now, having an absolute monster game with the heels. Yeah. Yeah, playoff Kaga here. No pressure, Colossal says. He did go down there in a moment where oh, he had a chance to get his, out. That wasn't his fault though. He was trying he's probably the reason why that game ends up in a tie. If Kaga falls there, that whole team pushes down and they they wipe them. Mm -hmm. So now it comes down to the seven best Marines. Wow. I really just wanted to go bust out some maps real quick and POE. No, there dude. Is, now, there now, is, now I'm stuck for OT? What is this is no nonsense? Maps, sir. <laughs> if Ghost Bomber would have just pushed Staley, this wouldn't be OT. Yeah, exactly. Maybe he was low, right? That's the only reason that I could think of. I mean, that... he hasn't been dodging all game, so that doesn't surprise me if he was low. <laughs> uh, wow. I guess you switch over Nas to a Marine for sure. <laughs> uh, yeah, I mean, um, he, he's got to play Marine. Yeah. You, I mean, uh, honestly, Paypigs are in a really good position to possibly win this. Um, especially with the momentum, the way they're playing right now. 
Uh, the referee needs to let them know it's Marines only. Uh, we've got currently for uh, Warhawks, we've got Staley, Fairfax, Kaga, Legacy, and Tactical. For Pay Pigs, we've got Splitta and Ghost Bomber, and now Kevin. Here we go. We, oh, well, I think we added the wrong team there. Manu and LT getting put in for Pay Pigs as well. Being told there's no NTs in OT. Hmm. Oof. Rip. Warhawks wins. Rough. Close it's game. It's time for it to happen. Currently sixes in. Is it sevens or sixes? It's sevens. Okay. It should be sevens. What a wild game this has been. All right, we have Splitta, we have Ghost Bomber, we have Kevin, LT, Manu, SV playing as Samara in honor of Danny and been missing this week, who would be great in this moment right here. Typhoon uh, also, who's had an outstanding game so far. Let's see him switch to Marine. Then we'll switch over to uh, Warhawks with Staley, Fairfax, Kaga, uh, Legacy, Stavadine, Tactical, and Gift. Uh, Eric and Yosh, you, you, you're both taking Warhawks on this? Is I'm that? Take, I'm taking Warhawks. Okay. I think Ghost Bomber is going to troll Pay Pigs. Yeah. First, you if, if you had to call first death, is it Ghost Bomber? Is it LT? Is it Staley? Ghost Bomber. Ghost Bomber. Very easily. I'm going to go. If Danny was here in I'm... place of Ghost Bomber, Pay Pigs wins this game. I'm going to go with LT off of a law myself. I think it's I, I do I think Warhawks are gonna do some murder right now with laws. I do think it ends up being like seven to you know, like seven to three quickly, and I may, may end up seven zero when the when the dust settles. What if this is Pay Pigs' strategy? They knew this, they big brained it, three hundred IQ type of stuff. They're like we're gonna get them to OT and now we have a secret play ready to <laughs> camp it out. They've got the vision bug of their own. They've just been yep. waiting in the wings. They've been waiting to use it for this moment right now. It's the long con. Well, if they do that, it will take this league by shock and all. Yeah. I'm, I'm ready for it. The USL Live community is ready for it. People uh, are asking, why can't Nas play? Well, it was eights with an NT. I know it, the rules don't state no NTs. It, they don't state no NTs in playoff or in OT matches, but OT is seven v seven. Nobody's gonna allow an NT over a, a squatty. Yeah. Kevin so. says, "Should I spec out like the suit tournament?" <laughs> this is Apparently, exciting. Splitta has never lost an OT. This is a good lead up in the playoffs. Good lead up. Split just jinxed himself. Now yeah. it's definitely Warhawks. <laughs> yeah, hundred percent. Same thing with Mecca saying, "Oh, I've never lost with Solve," and next week we end up losing. <laughs> right. <laughs> uh, uh, don't think I don't think I don't remember that Mecca. <laughs> here we go. All right, here it is. Uh, tactical just uh, died out. Uh, oh, he's done. Whoa! Unspec him. Unspec him. You, you should be able to un manually unspec him. Oh, whoa, Warhawks! There you oh, go. Oh my gosh! Easy win. Oh, what is going did, on? A did field. he um? Did he respawn as the game started? Like they killed. I think they killed him. And yeah, he respawned I, again as yeah, it restarted. Yeah, that's what happened. I'm looking at it now. Appeal. <clears throat> <laughs> I don't think it's it's upset anything yet. We don't have contact, but it will change the way that Warhawks engage. Uh, we've got a few of them going very far south. Pay pigs, that is. Uh, Warhawks are kind of in mid. Uh, Ghost bomber, in fact, in might oh, and Rio. They're they're looking to get Ghost bomber on oh, his solo I, flanks here, I, and they're I, gonna catch him. He doesn't yeah. see them way above him. Oh, I, gift is looking. 
I yep. do not like Ghost Bobber being a solo. This nope. is hard trolling. Especially right now. No. Yeah. I would probably put Typhoon on that role if you're going to put somebody. Because <clears throat> Leg- Legacy is getting all the way through it, through their base, and he's going to have that right side on him. Well, let me check, see where, where Rio is at. Oh, he's... oh he, yeah. He, he came back around. Okay. This is a big moment for Ernie. This is a this is a moment for Ernie to shine, and he's looking like he wants it. We got Rio all the way in their base at this point. Kevin is just hiding behind this rock. Uh, as Ghost Bomber pushes back up, we're gonna have Ghost Bomber Rio. Looks like to start this out. Stay I will leave. say this, Ghost Bomber's at least respecting it and falling back instead of hugging those positions that he was in the in the regular match. Is the a goal to here to lure them south so that Kevin is completely just ambushes them as they push in? I think I think so. I think Kevin is is the man here that's mm-hmm. going to make the play. He's a, he'll be a good one to do it too, man. I especially on uh I I think Gift could totally be caught like that. Rio might have a better reaction. I mean, at, in this type of situation, Rio is, he's got the north angle with Fax up here, but ammo could be a consideration. Fairfax yeah. moves through base to get a better position here. He's going to have a good look at Ghost Bomber. Ghost Bomber. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> Ghost Bo- Called it. Ghost Bomber yeah, is going to be first out for sure, as Fairfax absolutely murders. Yeah, I mean, go. Kevin go gets. The weakest player. Kevin's going to get caught now out, unfortunately. Yeah, Kevin's dead. Yeah. It's over. Ripper Roney. Yeah. SV and the team is pushing left. They're going to try and cut this left team off if they can hold him up. Yeah, now, now Pay Pigs is just getting desperate. Man, you good law, though. Kaga coming in behind him now. LT about to go down. Oh man, yeah, they're down. Goes down. Oh, Fairfax is down. down. Doesn't matter. It's an easy win for Warhawks. Yeah. LT's dead. SV's dead. Game over. What a game. And that'll do it. Hey, pigs, go down. What was it? A final there? Five, five, zero, five still in for Warhawks. Seven to two victory. Yep. Yep. Stavadine and Typhoon pick up those kills along with Ernie, Rio, Kaga, Gift, and Fairfax. Uh, really, really good game there. Really thoroughly enjoyed it. Um, I don't know if one of you, Yoshi, mind reaching out and see if we can get Gift or somebody in here. Yeah, let me see if I can get... Uh, Just to rehash yeah. again, Kevin and Kaga uh, leading with 12 kills in the game. Really good job from both of them. Ernie with 10 and 6. That's good now. Um... Stavadine gets the MVP for this game. Had a pretty good job of metting. Did a really good job, actually, today. Uh, TG's in the, in the, oh, okay. Okay. the channel. Gift, can you hear us now? Hello. Hello, hello. Uh, fantastic game. What a wild one. Uh, one of the only games I've seen come down to a tie. What were your thoughts about that? Uh, that's the sloppiest game that we've played all season. PoE is killing us. <laughs> <laughs> that and NCAA, am I right? True. <laughs> <laughs> well, are you guys planning on shaking off the rust for playoffs? Is that the we're going to come back and, and practice a little bit? Uh, doubtful. 
Doubtful. Okay. I like the optimism in true uh, TG form. <laughs> Uh, you know, Kaga and Tactical did come through for you. I thought both of them played really well. Kaga leading the scores for you guys. Uh, Ernie with 10. Um, what, what can you say about your, your lead Marines there? Yeah, I mean, same every week for Kaga and Ernie. They always show up and show out. Ernie will play any class we need him to, you know. Yeah. Can't say enough about those guys. Same Rio, the same thing all season. Yeah, for sure. And as Tactical played the demo today, you're on the other side. You had a pretty good demo in Typhoon. Did you have to adjust your game around him? Because he, he was kind of on fire all day. He was? I, I guess I didn't even notice. Oh, he was scoring hits left and right on you guys. Um, oh, yeah. I didn't really see him, so I don't know. Yeah. Uh, I don't know that the kills really showed it in the end, but he, he got a lot of really clutch hits that kind of made the difference in terms of their pushes. Speaking of another person who made a big difference was uh, Nos as the Ripper. Did you feel that Ripper in the in, in the field tonight? Oh, uh, yeah, Ripper a little bit. This map is very hard to push south. Like, we wanted to push south a lot, but we really couldn't. And then mm -hmm. I had some terrible deaths myself, so I'm, uh, south is I'm just, a... just hard to push. I'm, yeah, I'm going to say this, Gift. Your your true MVP was Ghost Bomber. Oh, <laughs> that out there. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but Manu did a great job with Medic. I thought that you guys str struggled a little bit on the heels end. Did you did you feel like the heels were there for you when you needed them? Yeah, no, I th the Medics played fine. We all had some terrible deaths, so there's mm -hmm. we're not active. We have, we don't SB. It's on us. It's, it was super sloppy. Well, uh, I said it's the, you're gonna, either going to be a, a, the start of the slippery slope or it's going to be the start of the comeback tour. So let's hope it's the latter. Uh, as Warhawks go marching into playoffs. Uh, congratulations to your squad and uh, to Stavadine, your MVP. Congrats, Gift. All right, thanks. Uh, guys, any final comments? I heard that one from Eric. Any other final comments you want to say before we wrap this up? No, nah, I'm good. Uh, okay. All right. Well, uh, that will conclude our broadcast of Pay Pigs versus Warhawks in week eight of season 23 in the USL. We want to invite you to join the fight by downloading the game on Steam. Just search Free Infantry or visit FreeInfantry.com. Uh, or to find out more about the Unified Skirmish League, please visit uslzone.com. Thank you to my co-hosts tonight. That'd be Yosh and Eric. Thank you to our executive producer, Military Police. This has been Romulox, and you've been watching the Unified Skirmish League on USL Live.